वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू ऑडियो वीडियो क्लियर ऑडिबल है ना ऑल ऑफ यू यस सो वेलकम ऑल द स्क्रीन इज नॉट विजिबल ओके जस्ट अ मिनट प्लीज इनवाइट योर फ्रेंड्स लेट मोर पीपल बी पार्ट ऑफ दिस फ्री लेक्चर uh this is for all science streams anyone who is preparing for cscr net exam upcoming cscr net exam or other exams also you can invite them uh life science mathematical science physical science chemical science earth science ye sara streams ka aptitude paper similar hai so this will be equally useful for all these streams uh one second it is not ओके इट इज विजिबल नाउ सो लेट अस स्टार्ट ये सेशन में हम मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन ऑफ डिसंबर 2023 थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री फ्रॉम डिफरेंट सब्जेक्ट एप्टीट्यूड पेपर वी आर डिस्कसिंग आज हम डिस्कस कर रहे हैं क्वान्टिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड एंड डेटा इंटरप्रिटेशन टॉपिक्स लास्ट टू क्लासेस ऑल्सो वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट रीसनिंग एंड क्वान्टिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड में नंबर सिस्टम भी हम डिस्कस किया था उसका भी रिकॉर्डिंग अवेलेबल है फॉर द न्यू पीपल माई नेम इज Christy Vergas, I am an author, aptitude trainer, and I have trained more than two lakh CSCR net aspirants in the last ten years. If you want to get training from me for CSCR net part A, complete course on CSCR net general aptitude is available. It is available in the mobile application Christy's classes. Check the description of this video to get the link of that, or just download the mobile application from Play Store, and you can join for this course. and now with this course 500 rupee worth material also is available flash cards are available and other uh, uh, resources also uh, by the time more people join just giving an intro about this course ye course ye sara streams ke liye common hai because for all these streams aptitude section is common and by attending this course along with csr you will get a, a idea about how to do questions from of gate and other exams also even if csr net ka targeted course hai ye but many topics are common for those common topic this course will help for the other exams also aur ye course mein 55 recorded videos complete theory previous year questions and practice questions will be discussed and um, speed matrix also we will be discussing in the class and these are the free study materials available with this course 100 online flash card 50, 50 topic wise study material pdf 50 topic wise practice worksheets and 10 uh, test series or 10 mock test available ye hai pura schedule sara topics csr net part a ka sara topics in depth discuss karega ye course mein uh, 55 lectures are available in this course and the structure of the course is every week five video extra will be added now 15 videos are there and every week five video extra and uh, in a span of about 1 1 and half months all videos will be uploaded and it will be available throughout your subscription period also so that is about this course all of you are welcome to be part of this course uh, free resources be a channel mein ya i provide free resources also in christyvergis.in website telegram channel whatsapp group and in mobile application christy's classes you can scan this qr code or follow this instruction to be part of this free resources or check the description of this video free resources links are available and in this youtube channel you can see a lot of free resources especially gate ke liye free complete course hi diya hai ye course ye channel mein that is complete free course for the upcoming gate exam and cscr net ka more previous year questions if you want 2022 all question papers of all subjects we have discussed in detail 2022 september june 2023 december 2023 all these are discussed in detail in this youtube channel so the in the present series we are taking selected questions sara question ka solution freely available hai ye channel mein so that also you can check out and uh, let us start Uh, हम ऑलरेडी लॉजिकल रीजनिंग और क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड का कुछ टॉपिक्स डिस्कस किया क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड और डेटा इंटरप्रिटेशन का पेंडिंग क्वेश्चंस और पेंडिंग चैप्टर्स विल बी डिस्कसिंग टुडे जनरल साइंस का क्वेश्चन ऑलमोस्ट जीरो था ऑल पेपर्स में वन क्वेश्चन पेपर ओनली हैड वन क्वेश्चन बाकी सारा पेपर्स में जीरो क्वेश्चन आया था जनरल साइंस से सो डोंट वरी अबाउट दैट एरिया बाकी तीन टॉपिक्स वी विल डिस्कस 
so last class we discussed about number system related questions now other chapters we will discuss some of those important questions and number system ka flashcard bhi we discussed uh, briefly and more flashcards if you want 100 flashcards you can purchase from the mobile application christie's classes or it is also available as a google book or kindle book also so okay so let us start percentage ka idea bahut hi important hai percentage how to calculate it mentally and different scenarios of percentages and um, we will start with this question december 2023 this was one data interpretation question asked try kariye all of you i'll give you 2 minutes to try all of you try this question and new students make sure you subscribe the channel so that you will not miss any upcoming uh, live class or recorded videos you will get notified if you are clicking the bell icon Any answers? All of you. Answer me, la. Okay, so I'll explain. Average monthly expenses in incurred by a family are as shown in the chart or pie chart. What is the value of the central angle corresponding to the amount spent on recreation? So. recreation where you can see recreation this 3000 is for recreation just a minute recreation 3000 so what is a central angle means ye 3000 ye total mein kitna region occupy kar raha that is what we need to find so total value how to find by adding all these value by adding all these value you can find the total expense and that expense mein रिक्रिएशन का शेयर कितना है दैट इज वॉट इज आस्ट सो एडिंग ऑल दीज वैल्यूज थ्री थाउजेंड फोर थाउजेंड फाइव थाउजेंड सिक्स थाउजेंड सेवन थाउजेंड एट थाउजेंड टेन थाउजेंड ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड या द थाउजेंड इज कॉमन सो यू जस्ट हाउ टू एड थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट टेन लेवन टेन ट्वेल्व फिफ्टीन ट्वेंटी कॉमन थाउजेंड सो दैट विल एड अपू नाइनटी थाउजेंड मतलब ये पूरा सर्कल नाइनटी थाउजेंड एक्सपेंस का रिप्रेजेंटेशन है नाइनटी थाउजेंड एक्सपेंस का रिप्रेजेंटेशन मतलब वो सर्कल है सो so 360 degree corresponds to 90,000. If 360 degree corresponds to 90,000, 3,000 kitna degree? Uh, 3,000 will correspond to what degree? You can directly say 90,000 ka one third 30,000 hai. Uska one tenth hai. So one third ka one tenth means one by 30. 90,000 by 30 is 3 3,000. So 360 ka bhi one by 30 hai. You need to find. 1 by 30th of 360 means 1 by 3 of 36 that is 12 degree otherwise you can use formula also but that is not necessary because formula way ya yeah, mathematical uh, paper math method will take more time that is why it is just enough to say iska 1/3 by 30th to iska bhi 1 by 30th because circle pie chart is a circle so central angle is 360 degree so i hope all of you understood it more explanation is also given here basic data interpretation question it was we will see uh, maximum questions from different areas so this was a mensuration sorry yeah, uh, geometry and mensuration related question make a try all of you
Okay, some of you got an answer. Let's discuss. The shape of a country uh, on a map is approximated by a kite. Kite means this is a shape of a kite. Again, this angle may or may not be 90 degree. It can be any angle for a kite. With diagonals of length 300 km each. Diagonals ka length equal hai. That is how we understood that ye 90 degree hona chahiye. The kite, we can say a special kite that is a rhombus. We can consider it as the rhombus itself because the length of the diagonals are equal. Length of the diagonal are equal. That is how we understood it is a rhombus shape. Minimum possible length of its boundary will be. So, A 300 hai, A 300 hai to. Boundary ka minimum length kitna hoga. Boundary ka length ke liye you need to find this, 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 this na. Rhombus hai to charo sides equal hoga. About this in detail we will be discussing in the geometry chapter in the complete course. About different polygons and how to understand the properties and all. How to understand them logically and then apply the mensuration idea on it. So, if you consider this uh, uh, diagonal 300, ye dono sides equal hona chahiye na, as it is a rhombus. Matlab, Pythagoras theorem use kar sakta hai. Base square plus altitude square is hypotenuse square. Here, base square and altitude square are e uh, equal. So, x square plus x square is equal to 300 square. Isko solve kiya to answer milega. x ka value, uh, uh, you will get x value. And that way you can solve the question also. So, find it. Yeah, actually, uh, I'll just show you. So, x square plus x square is equal to 300 square. So, 2 times x square is equal to 300 square. So, x square is equal to 300 square plus 300 square by 2. And x is equal to root of 300 square. That is 300 by root 2. x is 300 by root 2. But x is not what we need to find. Question is asking the boundaries. Na? Question is asking about the boundaries. Minimum possible length of its boundary means it is not x, it is 4x. x ka value ye hai. So you need 4x value. 4x value is what we need. 4x value matlab 4 times 300 into root 2. 4 times 300 into root 2. 4 is 2 into 2. 2 and root 2 cancel ki ata root 2 milega. So 2 root 2 into 300. 2 root 2 into 300. 2 into 300, 600. Hai. 600 root 2 hoga answer. Again, this is where your approximation skills will give you the answer super fast. Use options. Here, there is a uh, correction. This is 4x is what we need. 4x is 848. 600 into root 2, either you can do the normal multiplication. Approximately root 2 is 1.41. Na. But, utna times waste nahi karna hai because look at the options. 600 into root 2, ye char option mein 600 nahi ho sakta. 600 into root 2, root 2 is like 1.41, that is much less than 2. 600 into 2 is 1200, 11, 1131 is more closer to 2. I mean 600 into 2. So, it will not be 600 into root 2 nearby. So, ye galat hai. Ye 600 into 2 se bhi siyada hai. Then this only will be remaining. That way you can do it faster. I hope all of you are understanding this approximation we discussed. That will save time. If you are not at all okay with that approximation, do 600 into 1.41. That is 141 into 6. When you multiply that also, you will get the same answer. 2 carried over 846. 1.41 is approximation. That is why we are getting 846. It will be near to 848. Now, So option C is the answer. Subco clear and I very simple question. It is all about understanding the meaning of the question. They have purposefully used the word kite to confuse you. But diagonals equal hai, usse samaj mein aa sakta hai, the shape is a rhombus itself. That is why the side lengths also will be equal. Next question is from mean, median, mode chapter or average chapter. Make a try. Basic statistic idea, statistics idea is needed in these kinds of questions. Make a try all of you.
Okay, so I'll explain. The following 13 observations are molecular weights of 13 compounds. Which of the following is true for the molecular weights? The mo molecular weights idea is just given just to add something more to the question. That have nothing to do with the solution part. It is only asking mean, median, mode. Mean, median, mode, you should know what is mean, median, mode. I have uh, given a separate flashcard for uh, mean, median, mode. How to find mean, all of you know arithmetic mean, sum of observation divided by number of observation. Median is middle value after arranging them in ascending or descending order. And mode is the most frequently occurring observation. So let us write it down. Mode and median find karna easy hai. So first we can arrange, this is the given data. Usko order kiya to, if you arrange them in increasing or decreasing order. If I am arranging in increasing order, 160, then 360 once, 162, 163 and 4, 565 and 83 and 84 is there. After rearranging. Is may abhi clear hai, 65, 5 bar occur kar hai, so mode is clearly 65. Now median kaisa find kar sakta hai, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, the question already told na, the number of observation. So that is already clear. Um, 13 observations are there. Uh, 13 observation means which will be the middle value. Middle value is the value that separates higher half and lower half. So definitely this will be the middle value, 7th observation. Because it's niche 6 observation and uh, upper 6 observation. Hai. So this is the middle value. So that is the median so 65 is the median so mode is uh, 65 median is 65 let us check options now mode and median should be equal mode and median equal how many options are there mean sorry median mode equal not equal option is so that is eliminated mode and median not equal option be eliminated mode and median equal in option c mode and median not equal in option d so that is enough to finish the question because here finding mean is the time consuming process. That is why you have to use the help of options. As I have told in many of my previous classes, when you do CSAR net aptitude, you should be flexible with the 15 shortcut methods you can do for general aptitude questions. So, here elimination by analyzing options is the best way. Elimination by analyzing options is easily elimination ho sakta hai and option C is the answer. This was also December 2023 net exam problem. Same type one more question was there in another paper also. But I am just taking one of those examples so that you get the idea of this type of questions also. Try the next question all of you.
okay most of you got an answer so basic permutation combination idea or fundamental principle of counting multiplication rule is enough to finish this question if one thing can be done in m ways another thing in n ways both the things together can be done in m into n ways vehicle number plates have two letters out of 26 letters of english alphabet followed by four decimal digits decimal digits means 0 to 9 10 digits in the decimal number system 26 letters means a to z the 26 letters in english alphabets how many different number plates are possible if repetition of letters and digits is allowed? So, every question of permutation combination, you should be careful. Repetition allowed or not allowed? So, here it is clearly mentioned repetition allowed. So, um, and question also confirms letters ka baad hi digits are sakta hai. There was a same type, same type gate exam question which was asked about four years back. Usme there was no mention that letter ke baad digit hona chahiye. Then the situation is little more tricky. Because you can rearrange letters and digits. Letters ke baad digits ya digits ke baad letters. Aisa bhi possible tha. That gate exam question. Same question got repeated in CSIR. But is may clearly mention kiya hai. Letters ke baad hi digits likna hai. Matlab letters ko mein L for letters if I write. First two, let, the first two positions should be letter, followed by digits. Digits ko if I use B, D, 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 four digits. Now, how many ways this letter can be filled or how many letters are possible? 26 letters in English alphabet, so 26 ways. Here also how many letters? I, how many means how which all letters can be used? Only one letter can be used here, but that have 26 possibilities now because repetition is allowed. If you use letter B here, you can again use B if you want or any other letter also. Now, here digit hona chahiye. Digits means 0 to 9, 10 possibility for that. Here also 10, here also 10, here also 10. Then you have to use this fundamental principle of counting multiplication rule. That means total number of ways will be 26 into 26 into 10 into 10 into 10 into 10. Into 10. Option B is the answer. In that gate exam question, instead of the expression, the value itself was given. That is little more tricky because you have to calculate the tricky in the sense time consuming. Here you don't have to calculate anything. You just have to look at the options and say which will be correct. I hope all of you understood it. So a bonus question for all of you. If repetition of letters and digits is not allowed, what will happen? Repetition of uh, digits, letters and digits not allowed if the question is like this what is the answer if it is any of the answers in the options you can mention that or if there is if the answer is something different you can mention that also what will be the answer allowed ke jaga not allowed hai to kya hoga answer not allowed matlab a letter use kiya to wo letter repeat nahi kar sakta matlab a to z 26 possibility yaha hai but the letter that is used here, that letter cannot be repeated. So, one letter less possible possible uh, only for the second case. So, 26 into 25. Similarly, for digits, for the first position of the digits, there are 10 possibility. But then that digit cannot be repeated anymore. So, 9 possibility here only. So, here also one digit fixed, here also one digit fixed. Wo do digits abhi repeat nahi kar sakta. So, 8 possibility here, then 7 possibility here. So, multiplying all this, that is option A will be the answer if not allowed was mentioned. But December 2023 question may not allowed, tha allowed. It was not not allowed, it was allowed. So, option B is the correct answer. Yes, Kishore and all of you. Is this clear? So, this one I will come back to. This was a profit loss discount question for the complete course live batch. Today we were discussing this topic only. So try this. Those of you are following this lecture live or recorded, do let me know whether this lecture is useful and do you want more such sessions in the future. And do hit the like button and do comment on this video. That will help this video to reach more and more people. And that way I will also be motivated to come up with more such free initiatives. So, try this question. Profit loss discount question.
thank you shruti thank you for the good words Okay, some of you got an answer. I'll explain. Sham buys a watch at ten percent discount on its maximum retail price. He sells it to Mohan for three nine six zero, making a profit of ten percent. Profit discount. These are two things you learned in school days. Profit percentage, loss percentage, discount percentage. These three percentages you have learned in school days, but you have learned it in a more paper math way or mathematical way. Which is very time-consuming. I will suggest you try to do this logical method or logical formula. Try to learn, unlearn, and relearn this mathematical formula with this logical formula. I will explain. Sham buys watch at ten percent discount on the MRP or the printed price. Pay ten percent discount. Mila. But in our printed price, what is it? We don't know the printed price. We don't know the printed price. So I will write MP or printed marked price. He sells it to Mohan for three nine six zero. So, Shyam ke perspective me, Shyam selling prices three nine six zero. Shyam selling prices three nine six zero. So the marked price, Shyam's cost price also we don't know. I am telling everything with respect to Shyam. Shyam ke perspective me, Shyam ka cost price kya hai? Hamar pata nahi hai. Shyam ka selling price you know three nine six zero. And what is the marked price? Also, we don't know, but we know there is a ten percent discount. मतलब ये marked price पे ten percent discount मिला, उसके बाद cost price ये है. Shyam is the customer initially. That is why we are saying marked price, discount, then cost price. If Shyam was the shopkeeper, marked price पे discount दिया, मतलब selling price मिलेगा. But we are telling with respect to this question, with respect to this question, Shyam is first buying the watch. So Shyam is being the customer there. वो customer के perspective में ten percent discount मतलब marked price पे ten percent discount. That is the investment he is making for doing a business later. वो business पे उसको three nine six zero rupees return मिला. He sell it to Mohan at three nine six zero, making a profit of ten percent. मतलब उसका cost price पे ten percent profit मिला. That is how three nine six zero. So उसका cost price x है तो and his marked price if it is y that marked price y is our answer so this x 10% added is 3960 that means logically you can say x ka 100% ke sath x ka 10% add kiya to 3960 milna chahiye all of you understood this that is what is written here 100 percentage of cp plus profit percentage of cp is sp instead of using this formula try to do this way so that is 110 percentage of x is equal to 3960 in the percentage mendel arithmetic class i teach how to solve this without writing steps like x by 100 into uh, total ye sab nahi chahiye you can just cancel it here itself and say this is 36 one percentage is 36 one percentage is 36 means 100 percentage of x is equal to 3600 
again this technique we are learning in the percentage chapter so 100% of x is 3600 means his cost price or his investment on this product is 3600 x ka value 3600 how many of you understood it if you want you can avoid these steps also and trial and error and find it that is what i will recommend but i don't know as this is a diverse crowd that is attending this session sabko wo idea clear hoga ya nahi that i am not sure about but if you can do this way what number plus 10 percent added is 3960 Trial and error career. 3000 ke saath 10% add kiya to 300. 300 add kiya to 3300 mil raha hai. 3960 nahi. 3500 hai to 350 add hoga. 3960 nahi milega. 3600 hai to 10% 360 hai. Add kiya to 3960 milega. That way you can fix 3600. Another common mistake some people make is. They think 10% profit means 3960 se 10% kam kiya to answer milega. Ya x ka value milega. No. The reason we have discussed in the percentage class, check out that lecture. YouTube free classes may be percentage ka lecture diya hai. Complete course, those of you are watching my paid courses, check out the percentage fraction ratio, those two chapters, where I have explained more concepts about it. So anyway, ye 3600 ho gaya. So the investment he is making, who? The investment Mohan is making, sorry, Sham is making is 3600. Or the cost price, of him, cost price of uh, Shyam is uh, 3600. Cost price of Shyam is 3600. That is actually after getting 10% discount. Na? Matlab marked price kya hoga? Same logic itself. Ye marked price pe 10% discount, uske baad 3600. So marked price Y hai to 100% of Y se. 10% of y subtract kar raha hai. That is 90% of y is equal to 3600. This you can cancel easily. 40. 1% is 40. 1% 40 is 100%. 4000 hoga. That is our marked price or MRP option B. I don't know how many of you understood this. This question needs, your, needs backing from other chapters also. That is why I am not sure. Uh, so, check out the percentage lectures. There you will get more clarity about these kinds of trial and erroring to find percentage. Otherwise, if you are not at all okay with it, go for the formula. You will still get the answer. But it will take double the time than the logical way of doing the questions. Uh, I have summarized here what I have just told now. All the solution, in-depth solution of all questions are added in the complete course. So, those of you are being part of the paid course or the complete course, recorded course, which is currently available at 1000 rupees, that uh, you can get this study materials also of all options, all chapters. Options start here. Uh, options we can do, Shikha. But that again, I think it will take much more time here. Because the question is lengthy, that options putting... Uh, here at least option B is the correct answer. If it was option D, it would have taken double the time uh, compared to this situation. Here also it is taking time. Srimanta, that gate question I have explained in the gate complete course. I am not taking that again because this lecture's objective is not to discuss that. Na? But uh, those of you are new to my classes, gate ke liye we have given complete free classes in this channel already. That is available as a playlist itself, about 50 videos topic by topic and about 10 video year-wise question paper analysis also is available in this Gate General Aptitude Free Complete course. Yes, this is a course not only for previous Gate exam, 2025 Gate exam ki liye bhi year relevant hai because we have added 2024 question paper solution already in this uh, playlist. We have extra added it after the exam. Okay, so coming back to... Uh, the next question. So, this was an age problem asked in December 2023. Age problem, two question papers me aaya tha. Ye question ye tha. Dusra question, ratio of proportion based age problem tha. Try this question. Little tricky question till you understand the meaning of the question. So, try to understand the meaning of the question. Then the question will become easy. So make a try all of you.
ओके शिखा फाइन गॉट इट यू कैन डू दैट वे सो ट्राई दिस क्वेश्चन ऑल ऑफ यू डन इफ सो आई स्टार्ट एक्सप्लेनिंग अदरवाइज वन मोर मिनट आई गिव ऑल ऑफ यू ट्राई Okay, so I'll explain. Some of you got an answer. In 1979, Ramesh's age was the sum of digits of his year of birth. So this question, when you read it first itself, you get a confusion. What does the question mean? Because there are too many things that is unknown to us. Ramesh ka age pata nahi hai, aur year of birth bhi diya, year of birth ke baare mein bhi mention kiya hai, aur 1979. में क्या है सिचुएशन वो भी मेंशन किया है एंड 2017 में उसका एज क्या है सो टू गेट अ क्लैरिटी स्टार्ट विद एन ऑप्शन इट इज नॉट एलिमिनेशन बाय सब्स्टिट्यूशन वी आर ट्राइंग वी आर जस्ट पुटिंग एन ऑप्शन टू एट लीस्ट अंडरस्टैंड द मीनिंग ऑफ द क्वेश्चन दैट इज अ गुड थिंग अबाउट एलिमिनेशन मेथड्स मेनी क्वेश्चंस व्हेन द क्वेश्चन इज ट्रिकी टू अंडरस्टैंड पुटिंग द ऑप्शन विल गेट यू गिव यू क्लैरिटी ऑन व्हाट द क्वेश्चन मीन लाइक फॉर फॉर एग्जांपल इफ आई एम पुटिंग विद ऑप्शन ए ऑप्शन ए आंसर है तो हिज एज इज 49 नाइन सो एज इज वन थिंग सो एज 49 नाइन है तो इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी नाइन रमेश का एज वॉज सम ऑफ डिजिट्स ऑफ द ईयर ऑफ बर्थ एज 49 नाइन मतलब 49 नाइन ईयर बिफोर ही वॉज बोर्न फोर्टी नाइन ईयर बिफोर ही वॉज बोर्न टू थाउजेंड सेवेंटीन हिज एज इज फोर्टी नाइन सो His year of birth kya hoga? Year of birth kya hoga? To find your year of birth, what you will do? Now it is 2024. So if your age is 22, your year of birth will be 2024 minus 22, na? 2024 minus 22. Because abhi 2024 hai. Now you are 22 year old. So you your year of birth will be 2002. Same way. Na, 2017 में ये पर्सन रमेश का एज 49 है तो हिज ईयर ऑफ बर्थ विल बी 2017 माइनस फोर्टी नाइन टू थाउजेंड सेवनटीन माइनस फोर्टी नाइन दैट इज टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटी सिक्सटी एट टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटी एट सॉरी नाइनटीन सिक्सटी एट माई मिस्टेक नाइनटीन सिक्सटी एट इट इज नाइनटीन सिक्सटी एट में वो बोर्न हुआ था अभी फर्स्ट सेंटेंस रीड करिए और नाइनटीन सेवेंटी नाइन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी नाइन में क्या हुआ 1979 में उसका एज क्या होगा हिज एज ऑन 1979 विल बी 1968 प्लस 11 इज 1979 सो एज इज 11 एंड अबाउट दैट इट इज टॉल दैट दैट एज वाज सम ऑफ डिजिट्स ऑफ द बर्थ ऑफ ईयर ईयर ऑफ बर्थ ईयर ऑफ बर्थ 2017 है 11 इज इक्वल टू 2 प्लस 0 प्लस 1 प्लस 7 दैट इज द क्लेम व्हाट एवर इज द ईयर ऑफ बर्थ वी फाउंड द ईयर ऑफ बर्थ सेवेंटी Elimination mother itself. So three years are involved. Nineteen seventy nine, year of birth, and two thousand seventeen. These are the three years. In these three years, his age we can list out so that there is a clarity here. Two thousand seventeen me option B answer hai. So two thousand seventeen me fifty seven years hai. 
So year of birth will be 2017 minus 57. 2017 minus 57. So year of birth will be uh, 1960. 1960. So 1960 year of birth. Hai toh, this sentence read it once again. Damesh ka age 1979 mein. 1979 mein matlab 1960 plus 19 is 1979. Na? His age is 90. That 19 is equal to sum of digits of his year of birth. Year of birth is again 1960. Sum of digits means 1 plus 9 plus 6 plus 0. 1 plus 9 plus 6 plus 0 add kiya 16 milega. 19 nahi. So option B B galat hai. I hope all of you are understanding. Now do the same for option C. Option C 60. 60 is the age at 2017. 2017 minus 60. 1957 is his year of birth. So year of birth ka digits at kya 22 milega. On 1979, whether his age was 22. Uske liye year of birth ka saath 22 at kar ke check kar sakta hai. Yes, it is 1979. So 1979 mein. Year of birth is 22. Year of birth 22 hai. Sorry, age 22 hai. That is sum of digits of his year of birth, which is 1957. With respect to option C, I am saying. So, 1967 ka digits are 22 mil raha hai. So, year 22, year 22 equal as. So, option C is the answer. How many of you understood this? Again, I am not showing you silly questions or simple questions only. I am showing you all varieties of questions. Uh, selected 30 questions from all chapters so that you get a clarity what all are the topics or what all are the things you should learn properly for the upcoming CSAR net exam. All clear? It is a time consuming question but if you practice more such question you can save more time. Similarly 2023 mein ek aur age problem tha dusra subject question paper mein this question you can try as homework is solution B you can post the video and check the solution option B should be the correct answer and 2023 may this is again whether we can consider it as a reasoning question or number system question it can be debatable because there is no idea hai, but basically it is a reasoning question itself so this was asked in three sorry four subject question paper char subject question paper may same type question tha 2023 Four papers have the same type question. So make a try. Very simple question.
most of you got an answer very simple question now in the following finite sequence of integers how many terms are divisible by their in immediate next terms yeah what is divisible basically that you should know that is the only number system aspect in this otherwise it is a reasoning question so we can say kind of a hybrid question so uh, how many terms are divisible by their immediate next term means 8 ka immediate next term 3 hai na 8 3 is a divisible nahi hai because it is not exactly divisible reminder is there divisible means exactly divisible without reminder so 8 is not a number that we are seeking for we are seeking for numbers which are divisible by immediate next number 3 divided by 4 not possible 4 divided by not possible 9 divided by 3 possible so 9 is a possible number possible 5 by 6 not possible 6 by 3 possible so this is valid 3 by 3 possible so this is valid 3 by 5 not possible 5 by 7 7 by 2 2 by 3 3 by 9 3 by 9 not possible 9 divided by 3 possible 3 divided by 9 not possible so 9 by 9 possible so 1 2 3 4 5 6 so 6 is the answer all clear now very trivial question and the interesting thing is this trivial question was asked in four subjects papers in the left to right obviously subject yeah <laughs> i'll tell you when you see the sentence you have no doubt that uh, whether you should read i n t h e or s m e s m r e t t x e t e n huh? so if there no doubt means how there is a doubt for this text also it is a text uh, in the question huh? so we read alphabets in left to right so the numbers also should be read from left, left, left to right so that is the simple answer for that okay so yeah in exam hall these kinds of doubts are uh, possible because in exam hall we have all the confusion so that is why it is good that you ask the doubt but the answer is so simple left to right like you read any text okay so the next question same question itself instead of any number they have specified nines so answer it fast Answer it fast. Okay, most of you got it. Same as previous question. Na? So, in the following finite sequence of integers, how many nines are divisible by the integers immediately preceding them? Which lay question me? Next tha, matlab succeeding. Here preceding means before. And only nines we need. First, 
identify all the nines so that you don't make a mistake in counting and preceding it means before 4 so 9 by 4 not possible so this should not be counted 9 yeah this also is a 9 this also 9 by 5 9 by 5 9 by 9 so this should be counted 1 9 by 9 second 9 by 5 not possible 9 by 3 3 possible divisible 9 by 9 fourth one 9 by 8 not possible 9 by 3 possible it's fifth one 9 by 1 possible sixth one so 6 uh, 6 now one second 1 2 uh, 3 4 5 6 yeah 6 will be the answer some of you got a different answer not 5 it should be 6 now all of you understood so and this was asked in one more paper this you can do as homework 9 itself immediate next so life science mathematical science chemical science uh, life science mathematical science chemical science and uh, sorry physical science and earth science had this questions i guess so four papers already had this type of question that is why i'm telling please take previous year questions of all subjects not only your subjects all subject previous year questions take one by one and practice that will help uh, to get more practice of more questions so yeah you can answer this also uh, you can answer it now itself and uh, those of you want to uh, get free materials and the flashcards if you want to purchase the online flashcard ebook or if you want to join our full length courses also the mobile application link is tagged in the live chat and in the comments or in the description of this video also you can find the mobile application link and the separate course uh, uh, course link itself is given so you are welcome to be part of those resources and courses um, Mobile application, we are planning to come up with more free resources in the future. So, download the mobile application so that you get uh, updated because we are planning to add students to a batch where more free materials are added. So, if you want to be part of it, you can download the mobile application now and get all those free resources. And, uh, uh, okay, I think we can complete here that question. You can try some of you already got. And if you want more uh, training for aptitude section, you are welcome to be part of our paid course. The paid course is a more structured course where you can learn general aptitude in a more systematic way. In lesser time, you can learn more. That is the advantage of that course. And it will have a lot of study material so that before exam, you can do quick revision. Before exam, you can take mock test. You can have enough practice material topic by topic all those things together you can get in this course the recorded complete complete course was CSER net part a ye agla CSER net exam ke liye june 2023 and december 2023 CSER net exam ke liye uh, uh, a targeted course hai. so you can be part of this uh, course uh, more details are there in the description of this video or check out the uh, uh, short video we have recently uploaded regarding this course also that way also you can get more information uh, Mahida that is already there in this channel check out this channel the playlist previous year question solution playlist is already there so and in the complete course topic by topic previous year questions are covered and flashcard ebook we are now giving at a special price of 99 rupee so the flashcards 100 flashcards the flashcards I am showing, all flashcards, 100 of them, of all topics of CSIR net part A, that is available in the mobile application. The link is given in the chat. By downloading it, you can purchase this flashcards also as an ebook. And this is the uh, complete course, recorded video course. A six month and one year validity courses are there. And uh, those of you attended this live class, do let me know what you felt about Okay, now it is visible, I guess. Okay, so anyway, uh, all of you are welcome to be part of our other resources also. And in this YouTube channel, you can already find the playlist of other uh, question papers. Last four years, previous year questions, year by year, you can find the playlist of it. That is of all streams, life science, physical science, chemical science, mathematical science, earth science. Sara streams ka question papers already discussed in your YouTube channel. Pe. 
So free resources itself, I have provided as much as I can. And the paid courses, as I told, it's a more structured ordered course that by joining it, you can learn more in lesser time. So if you already have an idea about aptitude and uh, just practice is enough, again, free materials itself will be helpful. But if you are new to aptitude and completely unaware how to start preparation or what to do for aptitude, the theory is missing for many chapters. Those kinds of concerns, I will recommend you to be part of our uh, paid courses because that is more systematic more and more holistic. Srimanda, I will try my maximum. Again, simple rule, more free classes if you want. If more crowd is there, I will be more enthusiast, enthusiastic to deliver more free content also. So try to let your friends know that is a gentle request to all of you and try to interact in the video because YouTube finds if more interaction is there in the video, YouTube also find that this video should be recommended to more people. That way more people we can reach to. So that way, so if you want more, more such session or more such free initiatives, I like to give free initiatives as much as possible, but time constraint that you may see CSAR gate ka bhi courses conduct karta hai UPSC civil services ka bhi courses conduct karta hai so all these things I have to also manage time so that is why uh, try to uh, bring more and more people for the free initiatives then more free initiatives will be there otherwise also as recorded content already a lot of free content is available in this channel if I conduct more live class or not the recorded videos will always be available. I will not delete any of these videos. These videos will be available for you so that you can learn more from that also. Especially if you are preparing for gate, complete free courses available in this channel so that you can use for gate preparation. And yet course CSAR ke liye bhi, it will be useful as a practice course. Except the non-verbal ability part, other topics will be useful for CSAR also. And uh, previous year question papers, December 2023, September 2022, uh, June 2023, Yesara papers ka solution already diya hai. That also you can check out. So that's it. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye. Today we can complete the session here. The 30 questions we have completed in the series. So check out the previous two videos if you haven't seen it. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye. And share this video to maximum people. Gentle request to all of you. Thank you.